To help stop the spread of the coronavirus, we all need to do the five. One, follow these steps to wash your hands frequently with soap and water for at least 40 seconds. Two, cover your mouth with your bent elbow whenever you cough or sneeze. Three, avoid touching your face. Four, avoid crowded places. Keep a safe distance from other people. Five, stay home if you can, especially if you have any of the symptoms. For more information, visit www.who.int. Good afternoon. It is 1.37. That's pretty accurate. Um, it's about 1.37. I'm home. And as much as I'm home, I try. Try being the keyword. I try and... I try and get dressed. Um, and to me this has just been jeans and a tee or just a nice flowing dress but not pajamas um, because I feel like when you stay with pajamas the whole day it, it, I, I don't know if it's just me but I really feel lazy and I feel like being a bum um, so when I get you know when I wake up um, you saw my morning routine that hasn't changed much just apart from the fact that I'm not going out um, I'm walking from home and you know just doing as much as I can indoors I did have to go to the supermarket yesterday but um, I went earlier the earlier part of the day and so it was a bit empty so that's good because as much as we're staying indoors we still need groceries and you know like fresh fruit veggies and things like that and i've tried to order stuff online my order has been cancelled several times um this once i ordered using a delivery app and it gave me a three day waiting time so i was like that's that's crazy so i did pop out you know uh yesterday and and uh, there was no other supermarket thankfully there's still food in the supermarket thankfully today is 20 when is today jesus i have lost track of time 25th today is the 25th of march um hanging in there yeah hanging in there i must i must confess that i feel a little bit worried um as the day goes by i get more and more worried I try to stay as optimistic as possible, but I just, as the days go by, I just feel more and more worried. This is crazy. I mean, I don't know. Uh, anyway, so yeah, working from home has been interesting uh, because who knew that we would be able to do this, work from home, work remotely, but we're making it happen. We're trying our best because at the end of the day there's still clients that you must service you know and now more than ever you need to maintain those business relationships because a lot of businesses are it looks a bit bleak to be honest especially small businesses uh, yeah but we're doing the best washing our hands sanitizing the house um, when we get deliveries immediately we unpack we wash our hands just just try we're just trying y'all that's all that's all we that's all we can do just try try and stay safe <laughs> i mean i have sanitized my hands so much i feel like i no longer have fingerprints <laughs> like i'm just it's just it's gone <laughs> um anyway watched a couple of uh, films which i have thoroughly enjoyed there's a film i watched called angel's share it's an oldie but goodie if you're into like it's like an old well not really that old but it's old uh british scotland yeah so the accents if you're not into the british accents and <laughs> not for you but i enjoyed angel's share i also watched bell that was very 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 nice based on true story um i also started watching i don't know if i mentioned this on my last vlog where my hairdresser came to to just so on this week um i started watching um self-made the story of madam cj walker um if you don't know who she is she's an icon you should google her um so yeah i've watched i've watched that i've watched a couple of episodes i think i've added two more so i think i'm on episode five or something um apart from that i'm not really consuming much telly instead i'm reading i have a lot of books that i haven't read um and it's just a good escape for me especially just to 
when you read you just get lost into this this world so that's good uh, my mornings are busy because we have all these like status calls every morning with everyone and every so that's kind of standard so you need to be up um and a lot by say 9 30 before the call goes on goes live so yeah um and i've been rambling for five minutes now i received a care package and that's the reason why i'm here i received a care package i I think I mentioned in my other video, I have to keep referencing that I had a luxury package and luxury unboxing that I wanted to do. And so um, as soon as I finished that, I got a, a message from a brand. I'm just removing my address from the, it's a really cute note though. Uh, I got a message from Canva, Canva Cosmetics. They wanted to send me a little care package and that was very kind of them, sweet of them. So I'll, I'll unbox this and then I have something else by a brand I really loved. Really love. I currently, I am still loving them. <laughs> and uh, they're called by Earth. I think I've mentioned them in my favorites video. If you haven't checked out that video, I will leave a link over here somewhere. And then we have doo -doo, something from Louis Vuitton. The packaging, it's so beat up. My God, the courier service delivered this to me and I was like, oh, wow we're here so let me find a comfy spot somewhere in the living room and then we can unbox this there's oh there's one more thing there's one more thing there's one more thing it's a very special thing ah how can i forget all righty oh i poured myself a glass of cranberry juice although my glass says it's been a gin kind of day well lately Every day is a gin kind of day, but this is cranberry juice because it is, as I said, one something. Um, even at home, I practice some discipline. Okay, just gonna show. Ah, so where do we start? Let's start with let's start with the uh, Canva. Um, oh wow! Has a little note. It says, "Hi Nelly, we hope that you're staying safe. Here is a care package that we have put together to get you through these difficult times. Lots of love." Oh, this is so cute more than just a pretty face. That's really That's really pretty um, I do own Can Canva cosmetic Lipsticks before I've owned some before But it's nice to see so they send me a couple of things. The first thing is a plumping lip liner Ooh. Okay plumping lip liner what color is this red one? just like that mm. let's do a little swatchy swatch oh that's a true red if I've ever seen one look at that oh that's gorgeous oh that's really nice that's almost ruby wool red this will be perfect with ruby wool oh wow so this is red one and it's called the plumping lip liner that's gorgeous. The second thing is uh, Nairobi edition. Okay, just says Boss Lady. Ah, matte liquid lipstick. It's called Boss Lady. Boss Lady. Ooh, another bold red liquid lipstick. I love bold colors these days, so this obviously is appreciated. Um, let me swatch that just next to the swatch that right next to the lip. Oh, look at that! Oh God, they go so well together. This is nice. Ah, this is so gorgeous. Oh my God. Okay, next. Oh, next we have this is so kind of them. So this is um, a brand. I think it's called C1000 UC1000. It's a health drink um, Wow, and it's just like a vitamin C booster, you know Like for your immunity your immune system and they've sent the vitamin orange and they've sent the vitamin apple Oh, thank you so much There's one more thing in the Put it back. Glambition. Okay. So, is this some 
eyeshadow palette? Probably. Glam Bishop. It's got kind of cosmetics at the front. At the back. Oh, the eyeshadows. Oh, they're really nice. There's one called Glitz. Uh, this one, whoo, this is a night out. This is a night out. It's called Glitz. When this whole coronavirus thing is finished, hey, hey, that's the one I'm going to be wearing every day, inshallah. That will be my everyday look because, I, hey, life is short. Coronavirus has reminded us that life is short. You remember when you used to see those memes, take the trip, buy the dress. I should actually have gin in this. Because if not now, when? If I don't drink the gin now, when? <sighs> Forgive me, I lost my mind for a second. So that's all from Canva. Next is by Earth. This I actually purchased myself. They did not send this to me. But if you want to send something to me by Earth, you know my address. I really love, love their shea butter. So this is the packaging. I mentioned this brand in my favorites video. Thank you, God. Um, I did not get oh, this. This was such a. Mm, I did not get the sheer butter. The first one I showed you, the pink one. What was the name of that first one? The pink one. I forget. But they were all sold out on that. I mean, it was a people's favorite. I see why. So I got the next best thing, and this is the the sheer butter. It's called oat cookies. It looks just like so. Just get a whiff. It smells like something I want to eat. And that's how they get me. Oh my god. Oh, it smells so yummy. Oh, it smells like a baked good, like a baked butter cookie. That's what it smells like. Nice. I usually apply this uh, after I take my shower in the evening because I just feel like it really moisturizes my skin. And then because I've just been in bed, it will just soak in and just. My skin just love this. It loves this. It loves this. Especially if you have stretch marks. I know. I know. There's a controversial thing about stretch marks. Why would you want to get rid of them? Blah, blah, blah. To each their own. But I like to keep my stretch marks moisturized. So I, I, um, I like to wear this at night. It's really moisturizing. Really creamy and yummy. And you'll smell like a baked good. You are the snack. You'll be the snack that night. You smell like one. Okay? Alrighty. Next. Two luxury items, Louis. Already seen this beat up bag. Then the box. I'm just trying to put this back. Oh my God! Oh. It's a gone case. Looks just like so. Um, this year I wanted to. This is a, a card, just before we, we, we proceed. The box that it comes in, it's a really big box for a very small item. Ba -bum! And it looks like so in the dust bag. This was such a splurge, but I feel like I needed it. This is the Louis Vuitton cosmetic pouch in monogram. Not Damier Bin. I had thought of Damier Bin because of the red interior. But I just, I wanted the classic. I wanted the classic. I've been really feeling this print. It's so gorgeous it's so soft and supple and I just like how you can just hold it like this I've been thinking of getting the not thinking it's just that it's not available I would have already gotten it the toiletry 20 is it called 29 or 26 see I even forget it's been so long but um, angel yeah angel I'm calling you out angel was like that's a toiletry bag 
why are you literally carrying a toiletry bag around like a clutch get this or get the ever clutch i don't like the eva clutch it's so dated it's something my mom would carry to a wedding so no i'll pass on the eva clutch but this this is cute just be like hey hey girl hey what's up mm, let's grab drinks mm, yeah okay cool what's here oh it's just my Louis Vuitton pouch Ooh. soon come soon come but yeah so this is my pouchy pouch it feels nice smells like it smells like what Louis Vuitton smells like it has oh I've not even told you what it has it's it's leather inside so it's wipeable see you can wipe it when you put your makeup stuff oh I could put my lip liner my canvas stuff i could put my canvas stuff in there just now so if you put your stuff like this and maybe the pencil is not you know uh the cap is not on tight enough and then you stain inside you can just wipe it then there's another pocket over here which currently has the lining it's got a texture card so what else is in this box we have the invoice very important like so, so it gives you the, I think this is like the courier thing because it was shipped to an address in the UK and then they sent it to me here. This is their return, return policy thing. If you're not happy with your item, it's just another, oh, there's a thank you card. Ooh la la. And then there's the actual receipt. Uh, this all this back in here receipts and, th and things and then it's the cute dust bag which by the way i've been using these little pouches to when when you could travel to pack like your undies like you can put here like your tong -tong 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 tongs in here I also put all this in here and start to use this one asap oh i love her so much she is so beautiful there we go i will leave a link i will be sure to leave a link of all these things down below just after you subscribe just open the box all this stuff will be there last but not least this is a package from oh god so i have new york times a lot on my phone and i've just seen a lot in this one now <gasps> prince charles 71 the heir to the british throne has the coronavirus he and his wife camilla are isolating themselves in scotland We proceed to give you what you need this is from Japan I'm just grabbing a scissors it came via post office and funny enough I picked it up on Monday today's Wednesday I didn't pick it up uh, I sent a writer he picked it up on Monday the post office was still open um, since my writer was still working he picked it up for me open oh God. open like so I took a risk so here's a little backstory and please don't do what I have done because this was pure luck when I bought this item I bought it from DCT vintage Japan it is not sponsored but at some point hi DCT you should sponsor me because I'm buying a shit ton of things from you thanks but excuse me however before we get to the contents of this package um so i went to the site i was just browsing and i was like oh they have a jewelry section it's a jewelry piece i was like oh they have a jewelry section this is interesting so i went and i browsed and i browsed and i was pleasantly surprised to find that they have jewelry they have cartier they have vulgari they have tiffany they have chanel jewelry so if you're looking for any of that stuff you know like the chanel belts that are very hard to find they have them they have a lot of vintage pieces this is however not a vintage piece but it is a piece that i had currently thought of of getting in earrings and then i saw it it's a necklace fine i saw it and i was like okay this necklace is cute and i feel like it's calling my name and the price was like are you kidding me it was so reasonably priced it didn't come with the box but it didn't come with the pouch so it is a necklace it is from the brand tiffany the necklace was 89 dollars 20 cents however i asked them 
I asked them to see over here reduce the value to thirty dollars. The reason I did that is because the post office has just become ridiculous. Where on earth do you tax people like that? Honestly, and I'm not buying it to resell it. It's just one piece of one item. Anyway, so I told them the same. So this thing is valued at let's eighty nine bucks. If you put that here, they're gonna ask me for 40, 45 bucks. And that's not fair. So I told them to reduce the value that they put over here because they have to put the value. So they'll put, it's like a dispatch note. So it says, what is it? It says it's an accessory. And then they put the value in dollars and then they'd say where it's from and where it's going. And so when you got to the post office, of course, because it said $30, do you know how much the guy at the post office asked? 1600. I was like, boss, so $30, 3,000 bob, the thing is valued at 3,000 bob, and you asked me for 1,600, is that fair? You know what I told my writer? I have a six hundred. Why? Isn't there no, for why? I feel like I've spoken about this so many times, I'm just actually annoyed. Why don't we have a system that just calculates the correct figure, the correct tax? let's not make up stuff let's not just guess let's not have let's not uh, hope that the person at the, t at the counter will be in a good mood and give you a deal it could just be a standard rate if i'm shipping something this is the cost i asked them to reduce this they did thank you so much dct however this comes at a risk because if this item gets lost the insurance company will only pay me the value that i put on the box so if you're gonna do this please do it at your own risk i was ready to risk it all and save myself a couple of thousand bob it worked so forget all the rambling it came it came in a stuffed box as always with the original invoice the one that says the real stuff that's inside and then this is how it was wrapped she wrapped it real nice for me in bubble wrap it is, oh my god So she wrapped it like so and oh i don't know if you can see it it's super dainty let me just get it out of the box oh it's super dainty she told me they hadn't let me just come closer they hadn't polished it so it looks just like that and it's an open heart necklace in sterling silver it's from tiffany i'll just show you i don't know if you can see this there so it says made in spain that's elsa peretti's signature at the back and on this side it just says the code and the tiffany and co there we are oh please focus Oh uh, shoot, it won't. This is really cute. The drop was I can't I don't remember what the drop what the drop was. It must say. Mm, no, it doesn't. But on the site it had all the information like how long the drop is and all, all that stuff. And I wanted to it to sit right here, so I think it will. If I can just put it on. And it's called the open heart. It's by Tiffany and Company. In collaboration with the artist Elsa Peretti. The earrings I'm wearing, which were a Prezi, are actually from Tiffany, and this is the New York City apple. It looks like an apple. It's also collaboration with the same artist. That's Elsa Peretti. Let's see. Oh, there we are. So I've put it on, and that's how we're looking. It's the open heart i love it i love it and you know i don't have a problem mixing my metals this is silver this is gold i really do not have a problem so yeah Do -do -dum, danzo so i think that brings this video to an end i hope it's not too long i feel like i've been rambling and rambling and rambling and um is this my mind i have too many tabs open I am talking to you, but my mind is on the Rona. Did you guys watch Salty Souls um, uh, live on IG? That's where I, I, I got the term, the Rona, instead of Corona. Ah, 
kids are so cool but uh yeah so my mind is just on the rona and i'm just a bit unsettled um i don't know god save us all that's all i'm gonna say so i'm just gonna tidy up and i think for real don't judge me i'm gonna put some real gin in there and then sit at the balcony and have happy hour it's now 2 15. <laughs> stay safe guys yeah love and life